everyone, and welcome back to Dredge. We are going to be exploring a new area today. We've already kind of been there and done a couple of things, but we have to find our artifact. So I'm very excited to start that, but before we do that, I just wanted to bring Dwight into the frame. He says hi, and he is supporting us through the terrors of Dredge. Um, let's get right into it. All right, we are at the old fortress here. I believe we are looking for fish for the researcher. Yes, so I want to find the little firefly squid and an aurora jellyfish. Okay, let's undock. I know it's late, but... Super paranoid. You are making some funky sounds, sir. Definitely. These are some octopus. I think it's funny that they make a. Uh... Oh, some dredging. That they make a balloon popping sound when you run them over. Like, funny, but also sad, you know? Oh, no. These have just got a little intense. the wood for that, but I definitely don't have the refined metal. Almost there for this one. Take a look in the encyclopedia. Nighttime. It's not nighttime now, so. Alright, so we have to wait until nighttime to catch the squid. So we might as well explore around a little bit. And some dredge. Thank you. I'm sorry. Bye. My engine a little slower than normal now. Okay. It's getting closer to nighttime now. If I were a squeed, where would I be? Nice. 
let's deploy these. Why not? Oh, I got a fish. Let's see if we can catch this octopus then. Oh, through here. I think I can. Maybe. Doesn't look like it. Not yet, at least. Maybe when they come back, when they surface. I thought there might be some more in this trench. Let's put it here. Here? Here. Cool. All right. That's right, we had a... we have a letter here. We're engaged to be married. He sailed us out to the very center of stellar region to see the lights. We talked for hours. Something we've not done in such a long time, waiting and hoping. Sometime past midnight, as we were growing delirious and hysterical from the lack of sleep, the aurora shimmered into the skies above. When I turned to see his reaction, he was already down on one knee. I cannot even remember what he said, or what I said, but I know that I said yes. The ring is beautiful, with a span of jewels going right the way around. I cannot take my eyes off it. P.S. I was not sure whether to write this until yesterday's date or today's, given that it occurred at the conjunction of days. But I feel that the news is significant enough to warrant spanning multiple entries. Cute. Now listen. I need some squeeds. Let's see about this little guy. <gasps> there we go. Okay, let's go and give that to her immediately. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're so scary. I hate when I hear a horn. You're trying to trick me. Okay, I have in my net this guy oh oh i got some squeeds that's great news we've got all the surface specimen okay but ah uh, yes i also need some from deeper down but that's going to be a problem why is that a problem i developed a device to retrieve samples from the abyssal zone this was over in the other research outpost before the attack I have an idea of how to keep the creature at bay long enough to collect these samples, but while I work on that, I need you to retrieve some prototype parts. Carefully. I suggest you go during the day, I wouldn't want you to be out on the reef at night. Is there anything else? Okay. Let's move these around so that I can fit. Let's sleep. All right, we're gonna rest up and then we're gonna go to the merchant. Hopefully those are still good even after I slept. Yeah, okay, great news. So we need to go over there and over there. Let's go over here first. I might as well try and catch a couple more fish on the way. Fit one more. Right. Wow, six fish in my net. I kind of like the net. Oh. Nice. I'll take you. Oh. 
while we go past over here, we'll go use that explosive in that area that we saw earlier. This is the refined metal we need, yeah. When in doubt, blow stuff up for refined metal. And I can tell you that for free. some octopus. Got it. Okay, I can catch one more. Go sell it. And then we will upgrade our hull. Okay. Doubt. amount of space. Okay, let's see. Let's see what other upgrades we can do. Nice, they can all fit. Lovely! Alright, I have enough for that. Not enough money, but... What else do I want? I think I'll go for the rods. A new rod space first. Okay, I need wood. I'll place these here. storage right now so I'll use that one for now nice and we'll rest okay we'll head back out Octopus. What did we get over here? Another spiny lobster. Okay. So now, I can inspect the equipment on the table. So she needs this. Nothing. Um, 
fishies. I like that each area has a different theme. I think mean, that's very fun. Where a doggo keeps barking, but I know. Blood snapper. Huh. Got it in my neck. But I know we already got the doggo. Hmm. Let's sell everything. Mm. I don't know these, but I'm gonna send it to storage. Just in case. Just in case we need it. Let's deliver these prototypes. Oh, radiant squid. I like the net. I think I made a good choice with the with the net. Alright, excellent. Let me assemble a device for you. This should allow you to catch speci specimens from much greater depths. Now I've developed a repulsion machine that produces a bright light and emits a high-pitched noise. It should deter the creature from attacking or enrage it. I'm not sure. Okay, I'll be the guinea pig, it's fine. Connect it to the... Oh my goodness, sorry. Connect it to the research outpost generator. You'll have to return and re-engage it every few hours, but other than that, it's completely automated. Okay. Great, now take a lo another look at the list of specimens. Ooh, these are the ones that I wasn't able to catch before. Jaw, giant amphipod, anglerfish, snailfish. Okay. Let's rest. Rest and then we will go and catch those fishies and set up the... Oh, okay. Great. Nailed it. Alright. Generator. Researchers. Oh, yep. We're gonna put him there. Oh, a research part. Yes. Creature at bay for some time. Alright. Rods. Nice. That's exactly what I wanted. guys into storage. Okay, I need this. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can catch any abyssal. Those are squids. Finally, they're so fucking squids.
think I got one of the fish you want. So I need a research part here, and I think since we have the ab abyssal now, I should be able to catch the... Hmm, where is it? Aberrations, maybe? This guy, yeah, okay. So let's return to... Gale Cliffs. Let's go this way. Am I right now? Yeah. So we're gonna go to Gale Cliffs, which is, uh, which is east of us. So let's travel east to Gale Cliffs. Hopefully, maybe we go and use this guy. Ooh. Just fully exploded, okay. Um, we will go. Let's go to Little Marrow and sell a few things here, but not before dredging this wood because we need that. We're rolling in it. Absolutely rolling in it. Okay. We'll go check on town over here, see how it's doing. It's behaving. It's as though it's reacting to the light that cuts through it. It swirls and crashes against the edges. From the top of the lighthouse, I can see dark figures seething in the thickest tracks out beyond Little Marrow where the light dwindles. Of all that I've seen, your light seemed to anger them the most. For all of us, some nights I still think I can hear the hum of his engine sailing past the bay. But I know he's gone and I don't want to talk about it anymore. Okay. Gale Cliffs we go. This way. Terrible driver, everyone. I will say, it's a little less spooky after playing at night quite often. Let's get a couple of these. Yeah, and we'll just send them straight to storage. We'll rest, and then we'll go and catch. We'll go catch the ore fish. 
right, tired this morning in the waterfall. Use the explosives. Oh, I sent them to storage. Right, silly goose. Seriously, hull damage just because of that? Okay. <laughs> well, I guess I gotta go repair my hull before we do this because <laughs> it's not. I'm gonna sink my own ship. Jeez. Mm. Well, that wasn't cheap. Okay, we need to put the wood here. I think new net spaces might be the move. Good stuff. Oh. I have some stuff in here, so let's sell them. I'll take one. Let's try this one more time. This, hopefully, should get us a research part. first. Hmm. Oh. Found an ore fish. <gasps> Two research parts. Your girl knows. She just, she just knows. Okay. Let's do research on the right on this. Good. Lovely. I think this guy. Okay, now. Oh, she didn't want this. She didn't want the fish, so I was able to sell the fish, which is great news. Let's send this to storage. Mm. Let's get our boat repaired. Let's put some of the things that we've gathered now. I can almost purchase both of the ones that I want. Two cargo. Install. Very good. Alright. Looks good. Let's rest. And then we will head back. Back to... Basin. Okay, we want to go just like straight across here, exactly where we're pointed. Ah, oh, came out of nowhere. There was no way I was stopping for that. I'm just too 
Happy D. Oh, dolphins. Dolphins. That's cute. You can't fish dolphins, right? In the game? I hope not. Oh, Lovely. Um. Yeah, so uh, we'll have to go and turn the machine back on so that the big giant spooky boy doesn't come for us. Doesn't come for our asses. That was a Nemo reference. Did you get it? Because the bottom of the boat is the butt. It's fine. It's fine. Small brain energy over there. It's fine. Check on my crab pots later. Already caught those. Generator. Yes, activate the machine. And head out. Perfect. Ooh. Gulper eel. Oh, that's that's the Yeah, yes. Woohoo! <laughs> I have no other words. That's what uh our friend was looking for. So more research parts. Yahoo! Oh, look at that. Down there. It's spooky. Okay, let's just get all of these. That's the relic. Okay, lovely. Let's head over to the fort first. Drop these off because I can't catch anything else yet. And we can look at what's outstanding on this pursuit. few of what you were looking for. So we still have to look for the loose jaw. We've got this guy, and we've got this guy. Perfect. Not anything else yet. I'll put this in my storage so that I don't risk losing it. We'll rest for now. And we'll undock. one of that. Hmm. Uh, let's talk to her first. Hmm. Oh. I'm a gulper eel. Two more research parts. Oh, did she say something about... What do you think of Stellar Basin? What beautiful crystalline water. It's a shame I can't take my boat too much further in. I've run aground on the coral too many times. Have you checked out the abandoned resort to the east? It's pretty impressive. There's probably something decent, some decent salvage to be had there. Yeah, we found it. It's kind of amazing how quickly it falls to ruin without people around to maintain it. In a few years, these pontoons would probably go the same way. That's just the way of things, I guess. Okay. What can we research then? Maybe another net? We'll research that net. We got a few things left to research, which is great. Fish market. Nothing in my net. So I'll sell these guys. I think I can buy. 
Do I need anything more in Abyssal? Yeah. We'll see. I might need more stuff. I need more of that. This one is abyssal. Okay. Yeah. Just that. I don't think. Is it still running? No, it's not. The creature has come back up. Okay. Search for the final fish that she wants. Okay, so I've reactivated the generator so that we can find the final fish. It's abyssal is what we're looking for. Maybe it's on the outside. Oh, that's an angler fish. Okay. Kind of southeast. Southeast. Like this way. Is it you guys? This way? Yeah! Great. Perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. Listen, I'm catching fish here. Fuck off. shark? A paranoia shark? Okay. It's fine. Oh man, I'm so paranoid right now. It's okay. I think we've completed this part. Yes. The good news is that I've honed in on what's causing the abnormalities in the ecosystem. The bad news is the samples you retrieved from the basin have dangerously high counts of cellular mutations. This all points to one thing. 
That thing in the basin is harmful to life at cellular level. It damages everything around it, whether passively or with intent. I need to write up a report on my findings. Sorry, our findings. Immediately. Maybe now they'll take me seriously. Maybe. I hope so. Oh, how rude of me. You've done all this for me. I've not got much to say thank you with. Um, you should have this. A book! This is something I wrote during my studies. I think it'll be useful to you. Thanks again for your help. I'd recommend that you avoid the area. It doesn't seem safe to be near the basin. Okay, let's sleep. And now let's wake up. Okay, those need repair. I think I can uninstall this now. Move this fish over here. Move you over. And reinstall you. Great. And install you. And reinstall you. As well rest until morning. What are we doing here? Let's read you. We'll take this to that. To our friend. Maybe our friend. I don't know. Is he a friend? To tell. So, I'm gonna go and sell these fish, because I don't have room right now to give him... The trinket? Whatever it's called. Hello, fishmonger. Nothing really, I guess. Let's repair my boat. gotta figure out the map but, but first let's complete this walk in and place the jewel-encrusted ring on a table by the collector. His eyes widen. We're certainly making excellent progress now, and I know what you're thinking. An item like this would fetch a fortune at any auction, but for, but for us, its value transcends material wealth. Regardless, you are due a reward. He opens the crimson book, its, its spine cracking audibly. Selecting a page carefully, he begins to read aloud. The words sound muffled, as though he's speaking through a thick haze. Banish? You hear a growling, cracking in your ears. Suddenly, your vision flares and both your ears pop. He closes the book. We must keep searching. I've been thinking more on where we might find another. I can imagine all manner of detrius swallowed by the silty muck of Twisted Strand's channels. It's worth investigating. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Okay. Well, we've been cursed yet again with an ability, and uh, that's great. We have a new location to go and adventure through, uh, Twisted Strands, so that's really exciting. We're going to go and check out some new stuff. Um, I'd love to be able to go and find that last piece of the map and see what X marks the spot means. Um, but I think I'm going to leave this episode here, mostly because I'm starving. 
So we're going to go and do that. We're going to go deal with that. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give that like a little tickle um, for me and for Dwight. Please and thank you. Um, and if you want to see more content like this, please click subscribe. It helps me create content for you. Um, thank you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.